We've had on and off rainy weather really since the weekend and we will continue to have a few more spotty rain showers, but the last of this is on its way out. So low pressure to our south that exits to the southeast. That'll help drag some of these spotty showers that have been spiraling in over the course of the day out with it. So as a result, you can see that on exact track radar. We really don't have much else for rain anymore. Not likely to pick up too much more over the rest of this evening. And we might have a shower to kick up briefly right before sunset. And then after that, it's quiet weather for a while. So the last of the spotty rain wrapping up this evening. And then we switch to a much more summer like pattern. Lots of sunshine and some warmer weather around the corner as temperatures uh, get back up to September levels once we get to this weekend. So uh, looking at tonight, the weather dries out partly to mostly cloudy conditions. Some patchy fog possible as temperatures dip to the upper 50s. Now with the patchy fog uh, that may reduce visibility, slow you down a little bit in the morning. Here we are at about three in the morning, starting to see some of that patchy fog form and we'll continue to have these little areas of fog. These little pockets develop uh, through sunrise. So this, of course, again, may slow you down a little bit on the roads. Make sure you adjust for that uh, during the morning drive. Elsewhere could have clearer visibility, so it's not uh, uh, for everyone, as you can see, as that fog and visibility will vary at times through the morning hours. In general, though, once we get beyond about 830 in the morning, that fog clears out pretty quickly and then the rest of the day stays quiet on the cloudy end with temperatures in the low 70s, but the rain showers are out of the forecast. Then looking ahead from there, we're going to be in a very summer like pattern for a little while because of what we call an omega block pattern. You can see how the jet stream kind of looks like the letter omega in the Greek alphabet. Basically, we're stuck under high pressure and a lot of warmth, and it's really hard to break this kind of pattern down, which means cooler fall weather is going to stay away from us for possibly as long as a week. So we'll be under this pattern for a while, resulting in temperatures in the upper 70s to low 80s, just like early September, starting this Friday and possibly lasting clear through the end of next week. So that's why these omega block patterns take a while uh, to break down and keep the same kind of weather in play for quite some time. You can see this reflected in our forecast back up to the mid 70s of sunshine on Friday, getting to the 80s on Saturday, and then we're just going to park it there clear through the middle of next week with a lot of sunshine. So quiet and warm conditions for the early portions of October and your most accurate 10 day forecast. Eventually, though, that fall weather does come back. We're back down to the low 70s by next weekend with some rain showers, very similar to what we're having right now. But as you can see, it may take a good week before we get back there.